Hello everybody, welcome back to Reenie and D-Man Gaming, this is D-Man, and today we are here with Skyrim. Yes, we are finally going to do a video on Skyrim, um, but I guess Reenie's already doing mod previews and that. But, I'm actually going to be doing the story, which, as everyone know, this game's kind of old, not really, but kind of. But it's one of the best games ever released, very well recepted, and I'd like to do a video on it. So here we go. This is the character I made. Uh, didn't show the beginning because it's just a carriage ride. But gonna show from this point forward. I think we're just gonna record everything I do. I was thinking about doing it just mission based, but I'm not sure yet because some of the random caves you find are what make this game so great. So I don't know. We um haven't quite decided yet, but. I think I'll end up recording everything. This video will probably just be the beginning and the escaping the castle. But for people who don't know the story, you start the game and you're arrested and in a carriage. Um, I think you were crossing the border. Yeah, you were crossing the border, and they caught you while the rebels were trying to were doing their business. So now you are basically about to be executed. Here we go. You picked a bad time to come home to Skyrim, Kinsman. Captain, what should we do? He's not on the list. Forget the list. He goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. At least Worthless you'll die evil. here. In your homeland. Follow the captain, prisoner. Seriously. Kind of crappy. It's like, look at this random innocent person. They've never done anything. Eh, kill them. Why not? Ulfric Stormcloak. Some here in Helgen call you a hero, but a hero doesn't use a power like the voice to murder his king and usurp his throne. You started this war, plunged Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you down and restore the peace. What was my stomach? Don't worry about it. It's nothing. Carry on. Yes, General Tullius. Give them their last rites. As we commend your souls to Aetherius, blessings of the Eight Divines upon you. For the love of Talos, shut up and let's get this over. Our... As you wish. Come on! I haven't got all morning. My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. And you say the same. You Imperial bastards! Justice! Death to the Stormcloaks! As fearless in death as he was in life. Next, the Nord is Oh crap, it's me. There it is again. Did you hear that? I said, next prisoner. To the block prisoner. Nice and easy. Well, here we go. Holy crap! What in oblivion is that? What do you see? <laughs> what do you see? You know, I quite never understood that line. Like, how could they not see that? Why do they need sentries? Like, what? <laughs> Come on. Cutscenes. This game's version of cutscenes. 
during dialogue, I guess. Um, yeah, I'm not waiting all day. Um, because I, I like people who haven't seen, who haven't played the game, and don't know the story, to really get to see the story. Maybe even consider buying it. It was great. You've never played it, you're missing out. With death to the storm clothes. Empire all the way. We've got to get inside. Come on, people, you gotta know. The Imperials are where it's at, not the dirty storm clothes. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. Was that really a dragon? To bring us in the end times? We should keep moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. There you go. Take a look around. There should be plenty of gear to choose from. I'm going to see if I can find something for these bones. Okay. Got to be ordered. To. In one of these chests. I'm probably look gonna around. be a warrior, just because my. I wouldn't say my preferred class, but. Actually, it's not my preferred class. My preferred class for every medieval game is a mage. You better get some gear. My, I probably learn magic here and there, but be a sword or two in one of these chests. What the heck? Look at my arm. Freaking veins are popping out. Yo. You better Stubby get some arm. gear. Got to be a sword or two in one of these chests. You can dual wield, I'm not going to. But you can dual wield. Get that off. Right. Give that sword a few swings too. <laughs> let's keep moving. That thing is still out there. Okay, let's go. And I have to relearn all the controls. I haven't played this game in forever. Oop. Got them like the pigs in storm cloaks. Hello there. Poor old prick. You won't get the fuck. Let me see if I can get steal them. everything you have. That's all your junk when I get out of here. Your garbage armor for your garbage armor. What the fuck? Get over here, you piece of ass. Bad piece of Where? <laughs> actually do like so for like books and that because there's a lot of different books like that as we just saw as I hit loot all because that's pretty much pretty much in this game you want to always hit loot all because all of it you want the loot in this game is great um uh, back to what I was gonna say I'm gonna probably do entire episodes just to read like one of those like those books that way for people who want to get more into the stories and just hear the books and that, you know, I'll read them and that way people can get to see more of the books and that and hopefully expand upon their knowledge of the game if they don't know about it. A lot of people do, but some people might not. I know one of my friends, he literally never has played Skyrim. This way. Honestly, you should. You like medieval games, you will like Skyrim. Torture. You like any fan- Oh, is he looking at that? Come on! Come on! You 
like any fan of games, you will love Skyrim. You Glad you're over here. Oh, yeah. Um, boop, take it for now, read it later. Um, happy to do this for the channel. It's really gonna be fun. Got my first shield. Read Mystery of the Empire, that will be fun to read. These boys. Dragon how I get oh, they'll come to their comrades. Shield. Oh, they're gauntlets. Oh, I didn't have gauntlets. Whoa. Is that what that said? Gauntlets or gloves? It, okay, it was gauntlets. I was right. I keep forgetting to just do that. And I keep backing all the way out. Not going to use two handed weapons. More of a one handed weapon user. Um, I guess I'll switch to the mace. I was going to use swords, but this mace is better, so. never actually used a mace in any game I've ever played, so. With us. You have no authority over me. I didn't even Dragon Age do I ever use a mace. I'm gonna use my lockpick. Oh yeah, everyone gets to witness my terrible lockpicking skill. As I almost just got beat on a novice. Do you hear me? I said to keep this under attack. You're carrying too much and I'll See, already, already gotten to that point. Just learn some magic, but still haven't lost enough to not be weighed down by it. I'm probably gonna. What well, I know for a fact, yeah, that weighs a whole lot. Okay, I they'll probably drop more soon, but for now. Welcome with you. Sure, take all my things, please. I think that guy's joining us. The torturer Lead wants me to, to my stay work. here. I guess he's accepted death. There's usually stuff in these, but I am... Um, no way out of that. Yeah, I, I guess not. I thought there was. Oh, there you go. Looks like a money bag. Thank you. Big bone meal. Useful for potion making later. I haven't talked to Rini yet, but I'm pretty sure we're gonna do, um... Some videos in that on... Skyrim, well, Elder Scrolls Online, not Skyrim, Elder Scrolls Online, I know that game's a bit more controversial, and, hey, they've improved in the way of not having the stupid monthly subscription after a $60 purchase, but then again, some of the th some of the design choices for that game are just questionable. Where's the way out? Just give me a minute. Master the Empire! True! This is the um, remastered edition for the Xbox One. Um, I do have a creation. Um, if you have played the new the games, you've heard about Creation Club. I do have one. It's for a crab, mud crab. Yeah, mud crab companion. Um, at this point, I don't think I'll get any more, but we'll see. They usually have free ones, and I usually grab them just to see what they are at least. Um. For like just regular mods, this gameplay will not have any, because Rini's covering those in a different video. But there may be the Creation Club one, I don't remember. I think it's in, I think it's uploaded right now, but I'm not exactly sure. Okay, let's keep, <coughs> well that's not a good sign. Oh, it's just a little... Venom. I think it's 
sells pretty good. Yeah, 21 gold for one venom. But, um... What the? Yeah. Nice, whatever that was. Well, he didn't even wait. <clears throat> oh, freaking one, well, two shots. One. <laughs> wow, that was that was <laughs> that was pretty bad. I thought he was like shooting. I don't think I've ever killed him one hit. That's cool. Drop some of those. I'm already near the end of the cave, so I'll soon be able to get to a city. all my freaking goods. This guy here. Uh. Wait! There goes the dragon. Looks like he's gone for good this time. But I don't think we should stick around to see if he comes back. Closest town from here is Riverwood. My uncle's the blacksmith there. I'm sure he'd help you out. It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it. Might when I'm just running around, doing in third person, that way you can just, I don't know. I kind of like it when I'm just walking around just to see my character, but in combat I like to do first person. Listen, you should go to Solitude and join up in the Hell of the Put, 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 put. Probably conclude this episode when I. Well, I got that mission, I wasn't even near him. I'll probably conclude this episode when I walk into the town, but I definitely will be back with more episodes. Like I said, either. Maybe I'll just do different episodes. Some for quests, some for side locations, some for book reading. Just a bunch of different stuff. Um, obviously the Warrior Stone. Warrior Stone, Warrior Stone is kind of good no matter what you choose because it has blacksmithing under it. And blacksmithing is one of the biggest things you need in this game. Some of the best are, and it just, it's, I don't know, it feels better to, I will be back for you. This feels good to make your own armor. So, uh, really, the warrior stone is probably the best for the beginning. Of course, there's the other stones for your preferred playing style. Oh. Come on. Let's do this. Come on. Come on. There we go. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> what? Oh, he died too fast. Take your pelts. Use you. How far am I from the city? Too far. I'm dropping something. No, no, I'll eat. I'll eat something. Because everyone knows if you eat, you'll lose weight. That's how it works. Don't, don't question it. It's just how it works. Raw. Some raw at rabbit. There we go. Oh, come on. Really? He passed me off. <laughs> Ew, I'm gonna eat something. Come on. I feel better once we're on the cover of the Look at the scenery in this game. I mean, really, just take it in. Beautiful. 
feel good to play this game again. I haven't played in like two years, probably. The last time was on the PlayStation 3. I have not played it since I got it for the Xbox One. I think I just loaded it up once and then was like, eh, nah, I don't feel like it. New to Riverwood? If you're looking for work, go see Hod at the main. I'll do the conversation with him. Hadvard said you could Every help day me. we get visitors in Riverwood. Uh, Hadvard? How do you know him? Top one sounds more cool. He's a friend. I promise you can help. I'd be glad to help a friend of Hadvard. <laughs> I'm well but aware. You didn't I answer my question. A dragon attacked Helgen you know and destroyed it. Had our lives came together. Yep, I know. Mm hmm. What? A dragon? In yeah, yeah, Helgen? That explains what I saw earlier. Really? Flying down the valley from the south. I was, so bad I was wrong about what I thought it was. Oh, uh, he kind of answered that. It was a dragon. Hadvar will tell you the same thing. A dragon? Here in Sky. What's this world coming to? First the war, now dragons. Trouble loves company. Yara needs to know there's yep. a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. I agree. Someone we should need do to that. get word to Jarl Balgraf in White Rose to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for I me, guess. I'll be in your debt. Um, do you have supplies I could take? Good. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. Help yourself to whatever you need. Within Ooh, reach. Do, 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 do. Thank you. And I'm carrying commission. How do I get to White Run? Cross the river and then head north. You'll see it just past the falls. Okay. When you get to White Run, just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace. Jarl Balgraf, he rules White Run Hold. A good man. Perhaps a bit overcautious, but these are dangerous times. So far, he's managed to stay out of the war. I'm afraid it can't last. I don't think he likes either Ulfric or Elisif much. Who can blame him? That's but good. I've no doubt he'll prove loyal to the Empire in the end. You support the Empire? He's no traitor. Of course. <laughs> Skyrim has always been part of the Empire. That doesn't mean I support everything the Empire's been doing lately. But Nords have never been fair-weather friends. Until next time. Take what you need, my friend. Within... Ah, I forget you're new to Skyrim. Jarl Ellis, if I should say. Although only because she was married to Jarl Torig when he was murdered. Ulfric murdered Torig, you know. Walked right into his palace in solitude and killed him. Shouted him to death, if you believe the stories. That's what started this whole war. The Empire couldn't ignore that. Once the Jarls start killing each other, we're back to the bad old days. I see no harm in it, if you have the skill. The grindstone will improve your weapons. Use the table to improve your armor. If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. Tell me about Gerda's family first settled here as woodcutters a few generations ago. She and Hod run the mill. I make a decent living sharpening axes and fixing the sawmill. People are rightly stirred up about the damn Talmor being allowed to roam around arresting people just for worshipping Talos. But was it worth tearing Skyrim apart and maybe destroying the Empire? No. Ulfric will have a lot to answer for in the end. Nords have always supported the Empire. 
And the Empire has always been good for Sky. Why are the Thalmor allowed to arrest people for worshiping It's from that treaty that ended the Great War, remember? When the Emperor was forced by the Thalmor to outlaw Talos worship. We didn't pay much attention to it when I was a boy. Everyone still had their little shrine for Talos. But then, Ulfric and his sons of Skyrim started agitating about it. Sure enough, the Emperor had to crack down, dragging people off in the middle of the night. One of the main causes of this war, if you ask me. Need any help around the porch? Yes, actually. How about you smith me an iron dagger? Here's everything you need to make one. Go ahead. Okay. So I'm... Like... What the... I'm... Okay. okay, I didn't mean to do that. It looks like he just found out I had his back, but I'm gonna equip... I'm gonna put these on my back. Okay, I have everything I want equipped in. Favorite that. Do this. This. Thank Make sure I have everything in the best equipment. Talos. Yeah, I'm sorry to interrupt, told but I need about Helgen. The finest weapons and armor. Okay. Why did they sell the one I was wearing? Doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. <laughs> Look at his eyes. Uh, that's funny. Put those on. Come on inside. Sigrid will get you something to eat. And you can tell us what happened. Thank you for these, Mr. Blacksmith. What? Iron boots, iron gauntlets. Already got some better armor. Look at that. I'm gonna craft that iron dagger real quick. Dragons now, is it? If you keep on like and I've got better things to do than this in the war What do I need for just better iron armor? Leather strips. I can always get the brand but that needs Cora Dump. I've never pronounced that right, so I'm not gonna start now. So I need some leather strips. I have the entire iron suit already. Everything iron already. I have nothing left of leather, and that's iron mace, so... Yep, there we go! The first suit of pure iron armor. Studded is not better, so that's doesn't need to be done. Um, obviously building materials for the houses. Yes, I have all the DLCs, so that will be a thing. Jewelry. Other products. Just saying, an easy way to level up in this game, and people who own the game probably know this, is to span craft iron daggers. Like, no doubt, the easiest, I'm gonna say real quick, easiest Elgin key. Oh, I thought was saying, like, what? The easiest way to level up is to spam, because look, one iron ignit and one leather strip. I can only build two right now, but. Leveling up anything helps level you up, and it vastly levels up. I realize I could have upgraded it at whatever, but it levels you up pretty fast. So, for some reason, I could just take these. I guess no one cares if the cabbages are stolen. Um, but this is D Man, Rini and D Man Gaming, playing Skyrim.
guys in the next video.